Uh, Lorraine, I know this is an IFS group, but I ask you a little bit more about coaching versus therapy. I have an IFS therapist presently, and I'm not too happy with therapy. Let's just say I'm looking for a change. Yeah, and let me address that. First of all, it is not uncommon for people like you, Lorraine, uh, to, to reach out. And I think that is a place of where there's a place for therapy, and I'm no therapist. I've been married to one for 13 years. I have a good network of therapists. But that spiritual aspect of where IFS, and I'm not talking one specific faith or another, I'm Christian, and IFS has helped me become more grounded in that. But uh, I want to meet people where you are, keep you where you are, if it's working for you, uh, and just it, so we can access that self. And I have found that that is where IFS practitioners, particularly someone with a pastoral training background, maybe have even had some pastoral counseling uh, experience, can come in and it can complement. I let folks that work with me make it very clear that I'm not a therapist, um, but and that it's imperative that they have a network should they need that. But I found also that the people that I work with, they do have, uh, uh, they find people like me at the right time and what needs to happen in that moment tends to happen. And it's pretty beautiful. Hope that was helpful. Uh, and so uh, feel free to reach out if you have other questions with that. I've lost my spirituality and I've been in therapy my whole adult life. It's not quite effective. And just, uh, yeah, just be with those parts that are coming up around that. And feel free, if you have other questions, reach out, send me a message here on Inside Timer and I'd be glad to engage more, but so grateful for your courage and vulnerability in commenting here.